Oliver, and today I'm going to teach you how to store your Airweave token onto the official Airweave.app wallet. And to start, we're going to go to docs.airweave.org because this is the official development gitbook for Airweave. So you're going to go here, then in the menu tab, you're going to go to the section where it says wallet, and then we're going to click on wallet FAQ, and you can see Airweave app web wallet. So here we are. I'm going to be doing a walkthrough by video. I already created my wallet and what we're going to do is we're going to send Airweave token to this web wallet. Now what we're going to do is copy our public address on the Airweave network and I'm going to withdraw my Airweave amount for testing. I'm going to send a small amount. It already recognized the address so that's great. Let's try 10 yep. just for testing to make sure the wallet works. And I'm going to do the withdrawal process. It's currently pending right now. I guess it's going through the confirmation. Soon we're going to be receiving our Airweave token very, very soon. This is what you want to do each time you create a new wallet. You can verify that, hey, you know, the wallet is working and the address is working as well. All right. So as you can see, our 10 Airweave token officially made it in our wallet. So anytime you want to send your Airweave, you can just click on send, paste in the public address that's on the Airweave network, then submit your amount that you want to send um, and I guess you can you know attach any type of data to this transaction which is pretty cool I guess and pretty much you have your fee at the bottom so you can keep in track of all your transactions by using tag so you can add a tag and you just hit submit and then anytime you want to review your transactions you just click on transactions you can view all transactions. You can just review just the receive transaction and the send transaction. But yeah, this is a highly requested video. So if you're an Airweave fan or an Airweave investor, I hope you found this video helpful. But until next time, this is Oliver and I'm signing out.